Hi, I'm Susan Blight. I'm Anishinaabe Turtle Clan from Kuchiching First Nation, and you're watching Remembering the Forgotten Women of December 6th, Aboriginal, of color, trans, disabled, sex worker, 2011 on blackcoffeepoet.com. I'm reading from Not Vanishing by Christos, and today I'm reading her poem, Maybe We Shouldn't Meet If There Are No Third World Women Here. My mouth cracks in familiar shock, my eyes flee to the other faces where my rage, desperation, fear, pain, ricochet, a thin red scream. How can you miss our brown and gold in, in this sea of pink? We're not as many as you, but we're here. You're the ones who called a community meeting and didn't contact the black lesbians, or GALA, or gay American Indians, or the Disabled Women's Coalition, or gay Asians, or anyone I know. You're the ones who don't print your signs in Spanish or Chinese or any way but how you talk. You're the ones standing three feet away from a black woman saying, there are no third world women here. Do you think we are Martians? All those workshops on racism won't help you open your eyes and see how you don't even see us. How can we come to your meetings if we are invisible? Don't look at me with guilt. Don't apologize. Don't struggle with the problem of racism like algebra. Don't write a paper on it for me to read or hold a meeting in which you discuss what to do to get us to come to your time and your place. We're not your problem to understand and trivialize. We don't line up in your filing cabinets under R for rights. Don't make the racist assumption that the issue of racism between us is yours at me. Bitter boiling, I can't see. Keep watching blackcoffeepoet.com. Thank you.